You're not okay I look into your eyes and see you fade away But we're not the same It's like we're on two sides of the Milky Way now what well, actually the day after when i last spoke to you yesterday i didn't film anything we had such a chill day and i was just feeling so tired yesterday so we literally laid by the pool from like it was literally like from 9 till like 4 p.m then came back got ready for the evening then we went to the mexican restaurant which i filmed some clips but me and jasper were honestly so full like we couldn't even finish our main courses so yeah i filmed a couple of kids but honestly it was so unbelievable so the mexican restaurant was one of the a la carte restaurants at our hotel it was just so nice like i loved it i love mexican food me and jasper were having this conversation yesterday and i was like my favorite meal if we're eating in at home and like what we cook at home is like pasta like i love a pasta bolognese and things like that whereas if we're eating out it is like mexican but tapas vibes obviously yesterday wasn't tapas vibes but like that is like my go-to meal so but yeah mexican has to be one of my favorites so that is what we had last night it was honestly so much fun and then we came up to the room at like i want to say like half nine and went to sleep and now it's currently like nine o'clock the next day so yeah we've definitely had a couple of hours of sleep but i don't know why i'm so tired i feel like it's the heat um but i feel like i do look super tired but anyway jasper's already gone down by the pool they've now put out this rule so when we first got here it said you can't like reserve some beds before 9 a.m which i thought was so good because like on some holidays you can literally never get a sunbed because people are up at like 6 a.m putting their towels out um but people were still just reserving their sunbed so we go down to the pool to like actually use the pool at like half past nine and all the sunbeds were literally gone so this morning Jasper's got up and he went down to the pool and there's like security guards going around like taking people's towels off and stuff. Um, so Jasper went down there and just, he's literally stayed there since like half eight, so not very long. I've just been taking a little while to get ready. But so today's gonna be such an exciting day because me and Jasper are gonna go do archery. Um, I feel like I've done archery before, but I can't remember like when I would have done it. I feel like it must have been on like a holiday before. Jasper's never done it, so that's gonna be fun. Um, but yeah, it looks so good, the little archery bit they've got. So we're gonna go do that at half past 10. So I'm gonna go chill by the pool for a bit. And I also might go to the gym later. I haven't worked out at all whilst we've been away, but I think it's also because I've been feeling like literally exhausted. <laughs> um, it definitely has to be the heat that makes me so tired. Anyway, let's go down to the pool. Let's catch up with Jasper. And we're also by the adult pool. Jasper just texted me then. We've got two sun loungers by the adult pool. The adult pool has to be my favorite. It's just like so chill vibes. And they also have like a really nice like bar there that does like the best lemon daiquiris like that is our drink this holiday like a frozen lemon daiquiri it's actually unreal anyway let's go to the pool and hopefully wake up a little bit more i'm actually so sad so my big tan's coming off and jasper honestly is looking like a golden goddess like he is actually he gets the best tan jasper literally could spend the same amount of time in the sun as me i stay white as a ghost and he literally just goes like golden brown even though he wears like sun cream and everything it's just like his skin just reacts so well to the sun i'm actually so jealous but honestly when we get off the plane i'm gonna look like casper the ghost and then jasper's gonna be like some greek god because yeah just, it's just unfair, that's what all I'm saying. But anyway, <laughs> let's go. So me and Jasper, Jasper's here. You boy. Um, we're currently walking to archery. I'm excited. We like Lego Lass off of Lord of the Rings. The what? Lego Lass off of Lord of the Rings. I've you never seen Lord, Lord of the Rings, so. <laughs> against the floor. When we are loading the arrow, we try to point towards the floor, not towards our feet, of course. And we have one more bow available. Robin it? I did it. <laughs> I only got one. 
No, I got one as well. You're actually quite good at it. We're actually not that bad. No, uh, you're pretty good. No. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> so we finished archery and we've just come and got some food. Literally got on a mess of stuff, haven't we? Yep. Literally so much stuff. Got some water, this is so needy because I'm so hot. But yeah, let's eat. We got myself a red slush and a soy ice caramel latte. It's literally the same same shit different day, innit? Such vibe though, getting liquids in. <laughs> so we're currently sat by the adult pool. Jasper's here, do you wanna say hey? Hello, just drop, went in the pool. Um, but yeah, it's so nice here. We're on a little like astro turf kind of stuff. There's a little pool bar thing over there. So yeah, this, this is the scenes for today. Josh was currently looking to see what the entertainment is tonight. Abba Street Party. Mm, interesting. Oh. Good evening, everybody. So I have just come out onto the balcony and look how nice. It's like golden hour. Look how nice it's looking. Everyone's obviously left the pool now. What is the time? Let me just ask Jasper the time. What's the time, Jasper? Seven. So it's currently 7 p.m. and we've just showered and we're just getting ready to obviously go for dinner and that. We're just eating in the buffet restaurant tonight, which is going to be good. So obviously we had the Mexico last night and everything like that. So the nice day by the pool again. Honestly, earlier archery was so fun. Jasper was actually so good at it. Like he'd obviously never done it before. I feel like I've got lipstick on my teeth. Um, but yeah, I was so pleased. Like. It wasn't actually, I wasn't as horrendous as I thought I would be, which was good. Um, and Jasper was actually so good at it. I was actually so, it's actually so hot outside still. Is it? I was like getting a bit sweaty on the balcony, so I thought I'd come inside. But me and Jasper have literally just done our COVID test to fly back to the UK. So basically you have to do a COVID test 72 hours before you fly back and then within. within. And then obviously we've got to fill out our flight pass and all that stuff to get, what's it called? Is it UK passenger? Locate Locator form. Um, so we've got to fill that out and then we should be all clear to go back to the UK, which is good. So yeah, that was the vibes for this evening. Just done that and now I'm going to dry my hair, get dressed. I also did go to the gym earlier. I only just filmed like a little clip of the gym, um, but it was so hot. Like, honestly, I was melting. So I literally was in there for like, do you know, how long was I in there for? Do you even know? In In the gym? Yeah, like I wasn't. I didn't actually do that much stuff because I was literally sweating. I didn't get. I didn't bring a drink with me, which was so stupid. I just assumed they'd have like bottles of water in there. Um, and I got there, there was no water, so I did like abs, and then I was doing some like stuff with my like booty band on the floor, and then I was like, I literally felt like I was gonna pass out. I was that hot, so I had to text Jasper to come bring me a bottle of water. <laughs> um, so that was fun-ish. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna go again. Like I might just leave it until I get back. So we've got two more days left um so this i was me and just were saying like earlier like it feels like we've been here for so long but also like we've only got like two days left like tomorrow's like our last probably like full day which feels so strange doesn't it yes, really. i just yeah it just doesn't feel like we should be going home this soon but it's honestly been so nice to get away so guys i am now already i'll quickly show you my outfit let me put you down i'm wearing heels but i feel like i'm not gonna wear them just because i never wear heels and they just feel strange but let me show you. So this is the outfit. Just like my little flare trousers. And then this little black crop top, which I think is so cute. It's a bit like of a hotter outfit, but I actually really like it. It's the one I got from H&M actually. Um, but yeah, I've got these heels on, but I just don't think I can wear them. <laughs> we are both. Now ready to go get some food. I am hungry. Jess was wearing a shirt again, because I actually love that shirt. No. It's, that was the one you got from Zara, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so who says you can't rewear an outfit? Well, I literally wore it for like three hours. Yeah, I love how we literally haven't made the bed today. Love that for I mean, us. We haven't made the bed. Pure. Yeah, we do at home. Yeah, but not here. Well, yeah, obviously not. Pure holiday mode. And um, to be honest, the only person to blame is you because. I got out I'm of bed always, last. I'm always the one to get out of bed first because <laughs> apparently it's my job to go and get fine sun managers. <laughs> of course, you're still tucked off in bed. <laughs> 
aren't we like that? I don't quite understand how I got that job. <laughs> I was saying about how you were quite good at archery. Mm. You were actually all good at it, weren't you? Mm -hmm. So your first time here doing it? I'm like, yeah. So, oh, you here next week, week, week or something? I'm like, nah. Go home on Saturday. He's like, oh, you could have been in it again. Like in the championship. Yeah, they were doing like a little tournament after Jasper got picked for it and we didn't win. No, I didn't get picked. No, you no, no, qualified. Let's, let's reframe that. <laughs> Out of everyone who done our session, I won. I won the whole hit this colour, not that colour thing. Yeah. That's how I got in the tournament. But, but you didn't win I the tournament. I got knocked out the tournament. Got it. But anyway. I blame the arrows. I didn't realise some of the little like bits at the end of the arrow, the feathers, or what would have been feathers, were like torn. Them. So, flight of the arrow wasn't quite there, so. <laughs> Bad workman blames the tools and all that, but <laughs> I mean, I can only do what I need. That is true, that is true. I can only work what I got. Yeah, so blame the burn arrows. But I had fun, so. Yeah, it was I good. I'll do it again tomorrow. Do you think? No. No, I was going to say. I, could, like, I was quite shocked when you, it was only you mentioned it last night, didn't you? Yeah, I was like, we should so do it. Every other time I've looked, everything's. Well, it's something like. It opens at 6 p.m. for the next day, and every, even that to time, book things. Yeah, yeah. Like early on, I was looking like every time straight away, and everything's book, 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 book. Yeah. Whereas I just happened to look last night when we were in bed, didn't I? Yeah. That's and nice. it was like limited. Well, we got the last two spaces. Yeah. For that time. So there we go. That's chats. That's sh we should play tennis. Seven bottles of water. Right? We. I always say this like when it's like we're in the room and it's aircon, and I think like, oh yeah, let's go do loads of stuff. And then when you step outside and you're literally sweating. Yeah, imagine playing tennis. Oh. Today, we're doing doing archery, which yeah, you're still doing a bit. Yeah. And we're dripping and we're in the shade. So hot, but yeah, tennis in the broad daylight, I just don't think it survived. So many bottles of water. Right, let's go. We've got dinner. It's actually quite romantic. It's outside with a little candle. Bad. That's Uno nice. Cards. Yeah, Uno card. Currently waiting in the hotel entertainment and a drink. It's the ABBA street party tonight. I'll show you. What do you reckon? Huh? Do you reckon any good? I don't know. So this is the vibes. We're a bit early, but we like to get good seats. <laughs> it's bigger than last time. Remember the other one we came past it like this time? Yeah, there's no one there. guys we've just come to the little sunset cocktail bar and we've got ourselves a little cosmo is it a little is it cosmo sun what's come called? to the little sunset what's <laughs> that a little cosmo it's sun cosmo sunset sunset cosmo it's called sunset well, that's stronger than normal. that is strong yeah. <laughs> thanks <for> that <laughs> Right. Good morning everybody. So it is our last kind of like full day. Day and night. Day and night, yeah. And then tomorrow we've basically got the whole day as well because our flight doesn't take off till 9.25. So it's another day in Cyprus today. We're going to head down to the pool. I actually plaited my hair last night but I thought, you know what, I'm just going to leave it in today because we're literally just going to be in and out of the pool. Although it does look a little bit messy but you know. We're on holiday, we don't know anyone, like who really cares? I really wanted to get like sun lounges by the adult pool, but I swear literally every single adult in this hotel wakes up at like 6am to get a sun lounge there. Um, so we're going to get one there today. I'm going to take my GoPro today so I can like film some of the pool and like in the pool and stuff like that. So that's what we're going to do. So yeah, we haven't actually got any plans today, which is going to be so nice. I feel like on holiday, like you want a good mix between like doing stuff and like just chilling out. And to be fair, we've definitely done way more chilling out this holiday, but even like archery and stuff like even though it wasn't much like it did kind of like break up the day yesterday which was quite nice so yeah i don't think we'll be doing anything today i might go to the gym again later but we'll see how we feel this hotel's actually been so nice but like there's little tiny things that are just like 
mildly annoying but it's literally not even that deep like the little like bar place where you can get drinks doesn't open till 10 a.m so from now until 10 obviously you can't get a drink does that make sense because the only place you can get a bottle of water in the morning you have to go to the restaurant yeah and have a bottle of water. yeah literally so yeah it's a bit strange that one and also the only other annoying thing is like literally everyone wants a sun lounger so it's just not enough is that i don't think no, they said, they basically said the hotel's like fully booked out and obviously there's not, I just don't think there's enough sun loungers for everyone. So it's like literally if you wake up at like 10 and try and get a sun lounger, there's literally no chance. So. But like the, when we first got here, it said you can't reserve a sun lounger before 9, didn't it? Yeah. And there's like things everywhere saying you can't reserve them at all. Yeah. But everyone still does, so. It's really. So yeah, and also it's like well we're located on Aphrodite Hills. I don't even know if I said the hotel, so we're staying at the Tui Sensatory Aphrodite Hills Atlantica Hotel. Oh, it's something along those lines. I'll leave it linked in the description box. But yeah, so it's actually such a nice hotel, but it's not like by the beach. So it's not like if you can't get a sun lounger by the pool, you could just go by the beach. It's not really like that, so it's a bit annoying. But well, it's not a hotel with loads of open space, is it? No, so no. To be fair, are the ones by, by the, the pool. pool. Yeah. So, anywho, let's go. Um, hopefully our room gets cleaned today. It's been ages, isn't it? Yeah, like they said they clean it every other day. Um, but they didn't clean it the other day, so it's been like four days since they cleaned it. Today is the fourth day, yeah. Yeah, so. We'll put the thing on the oh. Also, we need to do our passenger locator forms um, to obviously fly back to the UK. We did our COVID test and everything, but we need to do that today. But I will give you a little quick balcony view before we head on out. I don't know if you're going to steam up going outside because it is quite warm. The view for today, honestly, not a cloud in the sky. It looks so nice lovely what are you most excited for i like your hat that's such a vibe that <laughs> <laughs> what are you most excited oh my god it's so right what are you most excited for about today just chilling just yeah finishing off our books got a couple of got a couple of hundred pages left but you never know i think it's like a hundred and something pages i got left in my book jack has got like a hundred left, I think. I actually just love the aesthetics of this hotel. Like, I don't know what it is about these like bricks, but I actually love them. Yeah, like it's just nice. We're sat over there. Over there. Over there. Gotta love the uh, morning holiday vibes. It's cute. Nice, yeah. No one in the pool. Love that. See, these are our sun lounges for the day been chilling here just was just sat there he's just doing the passenger locator forms um fast to go back home so yeah this is where we are today Just been in the pool. We just got out. We're gonna go get some food now. What are you doing? They've been in the sun, so they've red hot. Just was just cooling down his slides with some water. It's so hot today, though, isn't it? Like boiling hot. We're thinking of getting food just behind us here. Hopefully, we can get a table, but we'll see. It looks quite busy. You're top. Don't know. Good up. But yeah, getting a bit hungry now. So let's go. Come to El Sabar. There's actually so many nice things on the menu though. We're gonna get the volcano nachos and the, I don't know how you say that, Nokia tacos. <laughs> chicken tacos. So yeah, chicken tacos. So that's the vibe. I've got a Pepsi Max, Jasper's got a Sprite. So we've got some chicken and like rice thing and some nachos. These look unreal, don't they? They look so nice. And we've also just got some tacos. We've got so much food. So excited to eat it all. They're very good, aren't they? Mm. That's so nice. What about your chicken breast? 
massive, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. Nice. Look at the beautiful sunset, it honestly looks incredible. Like the camera definitely doesn't do it justice, but look how nice it looks. I am so obsessed. Just got ready for the evening. I wanna wear this cute little white dress from H&M, but I just feel like it's way too creased. What do you think, Jasper? Yeah, who cares? I don't know. I feel like it's just a little bit like creased, but then when I sat down, it's gonna crease anyway. It is a cute little upper shoulder dress. I don't know. But anyway, we are just getting ready. We're going to the Chinese... Is it Jasmine restaurant? Is it Chinese? Japanese. Japanese. But we've literally got to go there in six minutes though, so I need to hurry up. So, oh, is it steamed up? So me and Jasper are now just walking to the Jasmine restaurant. We're a little bit late, but you know. Is that steamed or is that the screen? Steamed it. <laughs> but I've just gone for the dress because you know what? Yo, like. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's so it's so hot. Like my camera literally just can't cope. It's so steamy. So we are currently sat outside. It looks so cute, though, doesn't it? So first up, we got some edamame and some vegetable spring rolls. How cute is that little thing they come in, though? It's cute, doesn't it? Jasper's net doesn't know how to eat an edamame. You just like break out the. In no, you don't eat the outside. You eat the inside. What are you saying? Nice, aren't they? Get them at Wagamama's. We've got a chicken pad thai and chicken teriyaki. It looks so nice, doesn't it? It's gonna look delicious. We have finished at the Japanese. Was it Japanese in the end? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Japanese restaurant. It was okay. Like it wasn't my favourite. Um, We're just not big fish people. Are we? No, it was definitely like a fish restaurant. Like so much sushi. Like if you're into that kind of vibe, you would have um, loved I it. I love the idea of sushi. Yeah. And the look of sushi. But not the actual reality of sushi. sushi. And they yeah. Didn't have any, some places I know they do chicken sushi, but they didn't do chicken sushi. No. So um, we had obviously the pad thai and the chicken teriyaki. The chicken teriyaki. Yeah, that was really nice. And the pad thai was like a little bit bland, I'd say. I'd like say it wasn't. It almost, it almost tasted like it was in an oyster sauce. Oh like yeah, maybe. Yeah, so I, I didn't really vibe that chicken thai. Um, so just having a little walk after dinner. And then, I'm not sure if we're gonna watch the entertainment tonight. It's like the Blues Brother comedy something, which not gonna lie, probably not really our vibe. Um, and we're feeling quite tired and stuff, so I don't know, we might go back to the room or we might go it's from last night as well. I know. <laughs> we're just like I feel so like tired. It just, just happens, don't we? Oh, it's sun you, you before you get there you're like, yeah. Gonna, gonna do gonna stay this. Up to this. But we've been getting up well early. For us, for anyway. We on a holiday. Yeah. So I feel like naturally we're just feeling tired. Yeah, you know, right? exactly. And just sun in general, don't it? I mean you just I mean you know, it's a hard life sitting in the sun all day. <laughs> It just makes you tired. Let's go for that. Yeah, I was just thinking that. This little adult pool at night. I just love like swimming pools at night. I just think they look so nice, don't you? It's like all lit up. Guys, I just wanted to show you how unreal this villa looks. I think you did earlier in the week, didn't you? I don't even know if I showed you, but it just looks actually insane. It looks better at night, doesn't day. Yeah, like, I don't know if you can get the full impact because it's quite far away, but and it's pitch black. This is like all of this here is like the golf course. You can't see it, but unbelievable everything's white yeah so many lights good morning everybody it is another day and it's looking amazing still we are currently in the room packing up all our cases because obviously it's our last day here and i'm actually quite sad to go home although it feels like we've been here for ages so i actually don't mind going home now um i just don't really want to go back to the reality of work. life work <laughs> yeah so Anyway, that's what we are currently doing, just packing everything up. So we're gonna go get some breakfast and then we are gonna come back, sort out our cases and then, yeah, go and yeah. chill by the pool. Yeah, check out and then chill for, by the pool. Our flight literally isn't till 9.25 tonight. So we don't get picked up until like, I think it's like five past seven. 
Is that what it is? Long. So we've got the whole day, which I, I don't know, like, I always feel like when you are going home, like I just want to pack and go sort of thing, but actually I don't mind another day chilling by the pool, so. Yeah, I'd, rather, I'd, I'd 100% rather get like a flight at like four in the morning, get here at like 10 o'clock. Yeah, have the whole day, day rather than getting then, like, here. The last day get picked up at like 10, yeah. Yeah, that is so true. It's always the other way around, isn't it? You get here like so late, the whole day, first day's gone, it's and then. Really cheap, it? Yeah. We didn't even have any choice, so. No. Right, let's go. Also, I've been trying to upload a video for like ages, and it's only on 24%. So I feel like this video is going to have to go up when we get home because it's just not working out, is it? I just still can't get over how pretty that tree is. It's really the little things in life, isn't it, Jasper? <laughs> How pretty the tree is. It's just the little things in life. You love cheese. I don't like cheese. That's a lot of cheese though. <laughs> yeah. So, this morning we've gone for a little full English breakfast kind of vibe. Let's be fair, I never usually like this sort of stuff, but I'm actually quite enjoying it this time on holiday. So that's what we're having. So guys, that is us pretty much packed up. Just just checking weight. <laughs> Is mine heavier? So probably about the same. Ah, oh, sorry then. Mine was like so heavy, so we moved some stuff out of there. Obviously we don't have scales, but that should be fine. Yeah, Jasper's case is broken. They, they obviously broke when we landed or, and like the handle's not working properly, but it's oh, actually. Chucked it. Yeah. Because I thought even the wheel's like bending out. I mean, it's not a very nice looking case. <laughs> yeah, Jasper's sister wanted it back because it's actually hers, I think, but now it's broken, so. Yeah. <laughs> so, we're probably going to take you to reception and then chill by the pool for a bit. Well, I should probably get to the pool first to take all the floats and stuff. And then yeah, right. Cases. Let's do that. Good plan, Joss. So, guys, I've got myself a little soy iced caramel latte. Although, I had to go get the soy milk myself because they ran out of soy milk at the bar. Um, they just said they don't have any, but I knew they had some in the restaurant. So I just went and got myself a cup and was like, can you make me a soy ice latte with that? <laughs> so confused when she first. Yeah, she was like, what? Like, look at the cup, like. Yeah, I know. Like, it's soy milk. Oh, you went to the phone, Yeah, literally, so. We got some, so we're just in the same spot as yesterday. In the same sun lounges. Sorry, it's getting hot. Oh, it's getting so hot. <laughs> So sweaty. Where, where did you do that thing where you can like, take a photo and turn it into the Instagram. Is it? Yeah. Let's give it a try though. I'm living for that. How do you do that? Mm. That is so nice. I had one the other day with almond milk and it just wasn't lot the same. How did you do it? Just take an Instagram story and then you can see the temp. Apparently it's 31 degrees, guys, so. No wonder we're sweating our tits it's off. Quite every day. <laughs> yeah, it really does. I thought we'd get more used to it by now, but no. So we've just come up to the lobby bar. Jasper's got this nice looking iced coffee. Yeah, right. Why is it always on the last day we get sandwiches? I know, and then I've got a Pepsi Max. Looks so nice though. Just outside having a bit of lunch. It's quite hot out here, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty hot. It's like 20 past two, so got a Pepsi Max. So bright though, he's put my sunnies back on. So we are now all showered, ready to go home. We just showered in the spa. It wasn't actually too bad, although the shower was quite cold. Jasper said his was cold as well. Yeah. Like freezing cold. So we're just now chilling in the lobby bar. We've got ourselves a little ice soy caramel latte. Jasper's just got one vanilla milk, but look how incredible they look. And then we've also got a little mini cookie thing, which looks really nice. So should we just do a little star? Oh, I literally spill that everywhere. So we were going to chill here for like a couple of hours before we get picked up. We kind of just had enough like just sort of chilling by the pool. We were ready to get like showered and stuff. So now it's just a waiting game. 
So guys, I'm now back at home, back at my house, and I have honestly had so much fun filming, editing, like just doing these holiday vlogs, and like I feel like you guys have really enjoyed them too. So if you have enjoyed the holiday vlogs, then please give the video a thumbs up. The journey home was actually really good. Like I was so shocked that we didn't even get like asked about our like passenger locator form, nothing like that when we traveled home. So yeah, that was quite surprising to be fair, because I thought they'd be so like so strict um but it really wasn't like that bad me and jasper watched wolf of wall street on the airplane home and it was so good like it's such a good film so yeah that is the end of the holiday vlogs fingers crossed we can go away again maybe next year or soon like who knows um we haven't got anything planned but if we do like that would be so fun um but yeah honestly had the best time just so glad you guys have been enjoying the holiday vlogs as well also if you guys just generally enjoy like vlogs like that is my main thing i do on my channel like i absolutely love just filming like everyday stuff so if you guys do enjoy that make sure you subscribe and other than that i hope you guys have a lovely evening and i shall see you all again very very soon bye